And they do on first down, and there's just nothing there for Jalen Buckley. Deion Burks is lined up way back at the tailback spot. Fake the handoff. Card rolling. Carr doesn't see anything. Looking to get it with his leg. Oh, loses the football, and Syracuse thinks they've got it. Justin Barron short it loose. And it's orange ball. Football. And he didn't do a very good job of protecting it either. Syracuse gives up some yards, but gets the stop. Yeah, don't let any receivers get behind your deepest man and go get the quarterback. Daly's going to have to pull it out. Intercepted. Daly let that one go on the way down, and Justin Barron was on the receiving end. Six tackles, a TFL that was big in this game, and then an interception that should all but seal it for Syracuse. Yeah, desperate moments for Bryce and Daly in this Army offense. And Clemson has been miserable in the red zone this season. We'll see how they do here on first down. In trouble, Plumlin being chased, throwing on the run complete to the 15-yard line as Stilato who gets dumped. Maybe four down territory. And it is going to be Mafa, and he's cut down for a loss and two by Justin Barron. Now it's fourth and five. Got a great lead and a sure tackler. Watch him work his way down here and make an excellent play on third down. It's just one-on-one. -on -one. It's Bill Malfa and Justin Barrett. He doesn't make that. May going back to work. Setting up the screen. Hampton. And dropped by Barron at the 30. The pieces are in place, both with his staff and the personnel on this team. Only the second time in the last 40 years they've started 4-0. The dump off to Hampton. He He's going to come up short of the line to gain. Let's see if they go for it. It'll be fourth down at about two or three here with 20 seconds left. Or they just kick the field goal? You would imagine North Carolina will take a timeout here. You're such a sacker. They're running on third down and one to Hampton. And he looks to be awfully close to that first down. Justin Barron got him, and I think he's short. Tunnel screen. The freshman, Destin Hill, he's got nowhere to go. Lost a couple of yards. Well diagnosed by Justin Barrett. You're going to see Keon Coleman right there in the slot. That is the guy that they want to get the football to here on third set. Travis into a tight window, and that one's broken up. Florida State dominant performance inside as we start the fourth quarter. Goal to go for FSU, another quarterback run. Ooh. Jitterbugging in the backfield and running out of room is Jordan Travis, and he goes down in the arms, down and goal back to the 10-yard line. You said he was jitterbugging, and the reason he was again was because of that low snap. Sometimes you try to make so many moves that it, not one works, and that was the case there. For and they're going to be aggressive. Five fresh players for the Orange defense, play fake for drones. Dangerous throw caught by Felton and immediately popped by that rover position, Justin Barron. Yeah, without a big explosive run on the night. His big one was 15 yards. Drones. Caught, tackled by Wright. Syracuse brings pressure off the edge. Pocket hold, almost intercepted by Justin Barron, who plays that rover position. Play clock winding down. They beat the play clock. Castellanos with a strike. Looked like it hit Bond in the chest. The tight jersey. The slarge. Yeah, the slarge. Two for two on fourth down. Castellanos reaching over. Tomlin goes wide, low snap. Castellano stands in the pocket. Hill, roll the show. Ball is out. On the hit by Barron. Syracuse picks it up. And head neck area. I mean, all of it is, it's there. Ugly play. Head and neck area. They're going to flip it to Rutherford. Trying to get to the edge. And boy, did the orange play that very well. 
terrific effort. Barron there first and then Wax. Jackets again in tempo. Second and nine and almost caught. Rutherford on the reach back. Carney. Second effort. Had to get to the 35.